Attitude 20, The Age The letter Shin, next to last in the modern and the ancient order of the Hebrew alphabet, was the third and final of the mother letters, representing elements rather than planets or signs of the zodiac. Shin is the mother letter of the element fire, and the letter itself is meant to symbolize teeth. The Egyptian hieroglyphic of a single tooth is shown for comparison. The Atu combining these symbolic attributes into one image is the Golden Dawn's depiction of the judgment, according to the expectation of a rapture at the end of days, when the Angel of Revelations blows the seventh horn, and all the dead rise from their graves to sit in judgment of the living. The Atu combining these symbolic attributes into one image in Crowley's tarot deck is his depiction of the Aeon, an idea he misinterpreted from the Gnostic concept for the 2,000-year solar span of a sign of the Zodiac. According to Crowley's idea of history, man had been around for only two eons already and was only beginning in 2000 AD to enter into the third. He called these the Aeons of the Mother, the Father, and the Crowned and Conquering Child. Here we see these three ideas depicted as Nuit, Thoth enthroned, and Harpocrates who is neither seen nor heard. Below these is the Hebrew letter Shin shown. At 221, Cosmos. The final letter of both the modern and ancient Hebrew alphabet is the letter Tau, signifying the phoneme T. Its shape symbolizes a T-square or cross, and its Egyptian hieroglyph depicts a nail. The final astronomical attribute of all is Saturn. The Golden Dawn Atu, the World card, shows a young woman robed with a purple banner juggling two batons, a flame at both ends of each, surrounded by a wreath outside of which are the animisms of the four elements. The final Atu of the Trumps in Aleister Crowley's tarot deck, the Universe card, shows a golden figurine trampling the head of a serpent, holding aloft its tail in two coils toward a golden eye in the surrounding night sky. Behind this figurine is a Trephile Mobius strip, and around the corners are the four elemental animals.